Welcome to Destination Diana, your self-help learning library, where we discuss all topics that are going to assist you on your journey to attracting a transformational love in your power partner. So I'm traveling and it just occurred to me that we have so many new people that are following me now on Instagram, that are subscribing to my YouTube channel, that are becoming a part of the love attraction uh, community. And you may not know as much about my story. So I'm gonna be putting up some content over the next few weeks to just give you some more insight. Um, you know, we're all on this journey of prioritizing the love that we give to ourselves and ultimately, you know, wanting to attract love in the life of our dreams. So I just want to share some background about me, you know, some of the situations that led me to create the Love Attraction Journal and ultimately um, focus on love attraction um, being like the main point of my business. So for years, um, I was in an unhealthy relationship, um, marriage, and I lost myself, like many other women, just trying to make things work in a very unhealthy situation. Um, you know, while my then husband and I still undoubtedly loved each other and our two children, I had to realize that love wasn't enough. And honestly, some of the things that I was classifying as love was probably just attachment, you know? I was deaf, excuse me. I was desperate to be the perfect wife and set the best example as the perfect mother. But deep down, I knew that the evolution of our marriage no longer aligned with the goals and the vision that I had set for myself and for the legacy that I wanted to leave for my family. It hurt to finally realize that for so many years, the love I was accepting was not the love I desired or deserved. So I knew I had to do something and I began journaling. I started asking myself the real questions. Um, what does love look like to me? You know, how would my power partner act, carry himself, support me, treat my children? How does this ideal relationship support my goals as an individual? Um, just so many things and I just started journaling through this. And in time, I was able to love myself out of that negative relationship, relocate my family and start all over again. But this time I started from experience. And that experience allowed me to attract the healthy reality that I have today. So all of the things that you see me post about, um, all of the luxuries that I'm um, enjoying, <laughs> all of the experiences that I'm getting to live through and share with my children, it's all a result of the work that I did. So. You know, it's all, I say all of this to say, everything we're experiencing, we're attracting. And I created my Love Attraction Journal as a tool to assist women like myself in their journey to become more intentional and purposeful with attracting people and experiences into their lives. I architected the life that I have now by envisioning this life. Um, you know, picturing the life I wanted and moving in that direction. So let me assist you with doing the same thing. You know, it's going to be difficult at times. The emotions are going to flow and sometimes it's going to be uncomfortable. But in time, you will unlearn your negative thoughts and patterns and you'll create a new reality that will attract the love you deserve and the life you deserve. So, if you don't already have a journal, Manifest in Love Fit for a Queen, go ahead and go to my website, destinationdiana.com, and get your copy um, so you can join the Love Attraction community and join a community full of influential women that are taking the success model 
and applying it to love, right? So I hope this gives you a little bit of background, um, a little bit more about me. I'll be continuing to share that information. And please share my content. Follow me on Instagram, Destination Diana. Um, subscribe to my YouTube channel, Destination Diana. And visit DestinationDiana.com to learn more, purchase your journal, or join the Love Attraction community. Remember, God is love. We are of God. So attracting love should be easy, especially when you have a guide. Mm-hmm.